Well, I was stunned. I was uh, really surprised. There are so many great people who have won it and so many great people who could win it. I, you know, how, why me? It was, uh, I, was, I was very happy, of course, and, and surprised. I was a scientist as a, as a young person, and I was just deeply interested in the way lakes function. Uh, uh, limnology brings together physics, chemistry, and biology, so it's naturally interdisciplinary. I've always been interested in why things work the way they do, and to answer that question, you have to go to a bigger and bigger scale all the time. The why questions always drive a more interdisciplinary view, and uh, those are the questions that always fascinated me. The idea of trophic cascades is that you can change the uh, fish community of a lake and change the water quality. Before trophic cascades were invented, it was believed that the water quality, the algae blooms and so on in a, in a lake, or risk of algae blooms, was controlled by nutrients. So, so the, the fertilizers coming into the lake were thought to be the only factor that controlled the water quality. The idea of trophic cascades is that uh, grazers, uh, small animals about this long, uh, uh, called water fleas, uh, can also control the water quality by eating the algae. And the water fleas are eaten by fish about this long, uh, called planktivores, and the fish, uh, the planktivores about this long, are eaten by fish about this long. And so if you add more big fish, you have fewer little fish, you have more of the water fleas, and they eat the algae. That's the idea of trophic cascades. I think the uh, next big advance that we need to work on is dealing with large catastrophic events like floods and, and droughts. And I believe that the natural science is making a lot of progress in understanding risk of catastrophic events. And we now need to work with the public and with policymakers to uh, uh, build resilience to catastrophes in uh, the way we organize our landscapes and the way we organize our institutions.